Well, obviously, uh, the hatred of Jews is something that uh, has existed since before Christianity. And the reason for that uh, was that the Jews had and have a culture that is different from the culture of the environment. And it is because of that difference originally that there was a discrimination against Jews, and which became a persecution. Uh, but uh, anti-Semitism occurred and came up uh, time and time again because uh, it was when there was a crisis in the surrounding society, it was easy to uh, to target a group, a small group that was defenseless, basically. Holocaust denial uh, means that uh, the Jews invented the Holocaust. In other words, that they are a satanic influence that invents things. To fight anti-Semitism, uh, governments are only one part of the uh, answer. And the other part of the answer is education, is explanation and, uh, and uh, uh, fact-finding, and a counter-propaganda that will show that anti-Semitism attacks Jews, but never only Jews. It is part, always part of something that ultimately engulfs the whole society, so that fighting against anti-Semitism within societies is a uh, way of protecting those societies from developments that could seriously harm or even destroy those societies. It is a fact that wherever anti-Semitism took hold, finally the Jews were obviously the, the target, but uh, ultimately it was the society within which anti-Semitism developed that uh, suffered in the end. Now, this is different in Muslim societies. And this kind of massive, consensual anti-Semitism is a real and present danger. It is basically genocidal. At the same time, the only way to fight it is uh, by recruiting anti-radical Muslims, and there are lots of them, to fight against a sickness that is prevalent in their own societies.